Hi everyone, Andy Klein here. I just want to say thank you for all the great participation on the bandsaw concept video that I posted a few days ago. That was probably one of the most fun comment sections to read and participate in, everybody sharing really, really good ideas. Um, and, and frankly, I think that some of the concepts that were shared could be starting points for improved ideas, things that were better than what I came up with. Um, so I've been putting a little bit of thought into the ideas that were shared and some tweaks and how they could be refined and perfected. Uh, and I wanted to share kind of my top two uh, new designs for a bandsaw that offers quicker blade changes. So as a quick refresher, my original idea was to have two blades set up on one bandsaw at the same time and switch between them just by raising the guard on the blade that you want to use and making either resaw cuts or curved cuts depending on which blade you choose. So a popular idea in the comments of the last video was to have a cassette tape type of solution where blades are contained in a large cartridge that has the wheels and the bearing guides and everything so that these can simply be swapped out, some kind of clutch with the motor, um, and, and you do quick changes that way. And I thought this idea was intriguing, but at first I was really concerned about how unwieldy these things would be. I mean, that's, that's a lot of weight to be changing around. I, I think that strain and pinch points and, and just the difficulty of changing these would be pretty high. But then I thought, well, there's no reason you couldn't mount two of these on some kind of hinge system on each side of the saw so that you can simply hinge one in and engage it with the motor and use that blade um, and, and then disengage it and switch to the other blade when you wanted to make a different kind of cut. Now this would require you on, on one of the blades at least to be cutting with the frame of the saw on your right instead of your left, but that doesn't really matter. It's a quick thing to get used to. That's just an arbitrary setup choice. And that idea actually leads to another thing to consider that's similar to some of the comments that were left in the last video. Why not just have both of those cartridges fixed in place on the saw? Not cartridges at all, just kind of wheels on each side of a center frame. You set one set of bearings and wheel alignments and whatnot for one blade and the other for the other. And then when you want to change blades, you just take one blade off and put the other one on. It takes a little longer to change, but you're not messing with any of the stuff that's really frustrating as far as adjusting guides and, and tracking and, and tension for a blade because it'll all be set up. Um, so you could probably do this change in well under a minute, a lot faster than current. So I think these are real strong options. Well, once again, these ideas are free for anyone to use and improve on. I'd be really interested to hear what you think of, of the new options um, and any thoughts on how they could be made even better. And uh, please feel free to forward this to your favorite friendly bandsaw manufacturing company uh, if, if you'd like to see these actually developed. Uh, I think that'd be, that, boy, that would be really exciting. If we could really get somebody to, to take on refining and producing this design, that, uh, that'd be really pretty cool. So uh, thanks, thanks again for all the ideas and participation. It's been a lot of fun. Bye, everyone.